Okay, so there's this guy that runs a flower shop, and he's doing pretty well business-wise until a whole bunch of monks open up a monastery on the other side of town uh, and decide to start selling flowers of their own out of their garden just to help with the upkeep of the place. Now, since they're, they're you know they're just monks, they're not out to make a profit or anything. They're charging like really, really, really low prices for their flowers. Uh, you know, the economy being what it is and everything, everybody starts buying flowers from them instead of from this other guy. So he's not making any money at all anymore. So he goes, man, I'm I'm in deep trouble here. He goes over to the monks and says, look. Uh, could you guys be a little bit more competitive with your pricing or something? I'm not going to be able to keep uh, a roof over my family's head. I'm not going to be able to keep putting food on the table if you guys keep charging so little for your flowers. And the monks just, they respectfully disagree. They say, no, I'm sorry, uh, that's just not our way. That's not something we're going to do. Uh, so the next day, his wife goes over and s just starts begging them. She's like, look, my children are going to starve and be thrown out in the street if you guys don't charge a little bit more for your flowers. You're putting us out of our homes here. And the monks say, we're very, very sorry for your situation. However, that's just not something we're willing to do. That's just not our way. So the guy's completely at the end of his rope now. You know, he takes the last of his money and goes on this big drinking binge all across town, getting thrown out of bar after bar after bar for being completely just absolutely trashed. Uh, until eventually he's in like the worst and seediest bar in town and gets thrown out by a guy named Hugh. Now Hugh is huge. He is a mean looking guy. He's just massive. Not the kind of guy you want to be on the bad side of. So he was like, man, you are absolutely gone. What is wrong with you? And the, the guy explains the whole story to him. He's like, look, there's these monks, and if they keep selling these flowers so cheap, I'm not going to be able to keep a roof over my family's head anymore. So he was like, all right, I'll take care of this for you. Next day, he goes over to the monastery and just walks up and says, just says, hey, I'm here about the flower shop. And the monks just immediately say, okay, look, we're not going to do, we're not going to sell flowers anymore. We're done with this. This isn't something that we, we want to be a part of. We don't want any trouble. We're just here to, to be monks and have our monastery and everything. We're, and they immediately just stop selling flowers whatsoever, start turning everybody away. And the guy's flower shop starts to get a whole bunch of business again, which just goes to show that Hugh and only Hugh can prevent florist friars. Didn't see that coming, did you?